Funko Mail Call from Entertainment Earth. Let's go. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to the Outsider's Edge, and today we're busting open this Entertainment Earth Funko Mail Call. And um, I did a video on some a part of this months ago because you know they came out with the first one when they announced it, but um, it is part of the a Legend Reborn X Men comic series. Now, in my opinion, this is you know one of the most iconic comic covers whether you're Marvel or DC everyone recognizes it instantly so it has the metallic looking I think yeah it'd be metallic um, Magneto you know he's got the hand up holding up that magnetic field power and this is part of a um, PX previews I didn't realize that they're all part of the PX previews um, exclusive but Man, this is definitely my favorite um, series. Um, I had the main comic whenever I was a kid, the one that has the the insert. But over the years, I kind of you know lost a lot of my comics, and you know I just am trying to get it all built back up again. But um, and the fact that they're mixing. Funko with comics, I mean, is an awesome idea that they came out with. And then next up, I got in the Beast one. Now, as mentioned, when you put them together, all four of them, they have like the panoramic uh, comic picture made by Jim Lee and Alex Ross. But, um, man, I just, I am so excited that they chose to do this series. And, um, you know, it's kind of the way they thought it out. I don't know, because when, obviously the comics have more, more than one character, so they only chose one comic, or one character within the cover to feature as a, as a pop. I've only seen very few that have, like, the more than one. I think the Harry Potter, like, movie poster had three characters, the Batman had you know a couple Batman and Joker but I guess if you put too much stuff it kind of defeats a purpose and covers the back comic but I don't know I think they're cool either way but um there we have you know almost the full series um there's one more yet to come they just revealed now they did kind of show and announce that they're making it but they just revealed that it was going to be Gambit as you see, and um, I was kind of hoping Psylocke would be the one, but I don't know. That's just my personal opinion. And outside of that, I have another one that I haven't, I don't think I've featured it yet. I think I posted a picture, but um, I got this Phoenix. It's X-Men 101. I believe I bought it at Target, but um, I'm trying to, you know, I've been debating whether or not I should take them out of the boxes and hang it because these do have, I believe these have it, yeah, they have the um, hole at the top where you can, um, you know, hang it up, so I don't know, we'll see. Once, once I get the last one, I'll make up my mind maybe, but I probably won't just because I don't take mine out of the box, so, but there you have it. There's uh, the Magneto Beast, and then, of course, the Phoenix. And let me know what you think. Which one do you like the best? Um, what's one that you wish that they would make that they haven't made yet? And as always, thank you so much for watching, and please be sure to like and subscribe.